U.S. business is not illegal, but operating outside commercial zones and indiscriminately on the street is an offense. Those are not my words, but those of the Senior Special Assistant to the FCT Minister on Monitoring, Inspection and Enforcement, Comrade Ikarata, who was speaking at the Area 3 premises of the Abuja Environmental Protection Board, AEPB. He is one of the officials who addressed the 47 point of sales agent, commonly referred to as POS agent, who we arrested for operating illegally within the federal capital city. We have gotten complaint, and the minister got so much complaint from people who said, People are doing POS in their area, they don't know them. Are we together? Yes, sir. They don't know them. So what we appeal to all of you is to please take your business, are you getting me now? Yes, sir. To commercial areas where people can allow you to stay and do your business. If you are in plazas, shopping mall, filling station, even areas around mugs, churches, inside the estate, nobody will disturb you. But when you are in a place where we get called, that please, so these people are here, I don't know who is by our gate. I don't know who is by our street. That is why we are doing what we are doing. He is not the only one who came with a message from the FCT minister. The head of enforcement at AEPB, Kaka Bello, says environmental laws forbid business activities at residential areas and on the streets. If you are carrying out a business where it's uh, in the wrong location, then is an offense based on the APB Act, and that is why we apprehended you. Your business must be registered in the right location. <coughs> if you don't do that, then you are violating the APB Act, the section of the APB Act, which calls for you to be apprehended and be charged with court focus. Some of the violators promise to operate only at commercial areas and sport. As a POS operator, if you really want to do this, pay an amount and have a place or a portion in a particular location. No problem. Anybody that truly, because it has actually taken so many people off the streets. I'm begging the government that some of us that we find ourselves doing this business, not that we want to do it. Because several times they have stopped us not to walk in on the roadside. But I come to think of it that I have nobody to help me. And now I find myself doing it. And I'm also begging the government to help us. The FCTA has vowed to continuously prosecute violators. But to what extent will the POS agent comply? This is what everyone is watching. Joy Igochi, ITV News.